Huh, covers for ebooks have, have really, you know, it, it's very interesting. You, it really has limited design in some way. Uh, you know, a lot of books, you want to have very fine, soft type and soft colors, and it's tan type on a light blue background, and man, it looks beautiful when you hold that book in your hand on print. And when you click onto a, an e-commerce site of a place where you'll buy a book or you bring it up on your e-reader, that beautiful 5 by 8 book cover is now 1 inch by 2 inch, and maybe the resolution on the monitor is not so great, or on your phone doesn't look so great in the sunlight. So you, you really do have to be careful. Um, there are some outlets that will let you post a thumbnail image that is different, but many of them will not. So we, we do take that into account when we do covers. So you're, you're going to want to pick contrasty colors. You're going to want to pick a, a chunkier typeface, even if it's not as beautiful as you might want it to be. Ultimately, even if someone is buying a physical book, maybe the first introduction they'll have to that book is from that tiny little thumbnail. On, on a website somewhere. So you really need to take that into account. What I do for a lot of my clients is when I, I design a cover for them, I will make a one inch by two inch version and send it to them just so they can look at it on their monitor and say, this is how people are going to see it the first time they see it. Thank you for listening. Please review our other available content for help writing, publishing, and marketing your book. If you have any questions about the Author Learning Center, please contact us by email at authorsupport at authorlearningcenter.com.